Hello and welcome to Nikolai's Genetics Lessons and today we are going to solve probability problem and here is a question, what is the value and we call this n choose k. This is n and this is k and this is short notation for, for example, we can also represent this as 15 c 5. Why c and not p here? P stands for permutations where order does matter and C stands for the combinations where order doesn't matter. And there are two ways how we can solve this problem. One way when we can use Pascal's triangle and it's going to take only a few seconds to solve this problem using this way. For example, this 15 here means that we have to choose number 15 in the second column. So here's a number 15 and 5 here means that we have to move 5 places to the right. So 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. And this is, as you see, our answer. Answer B. And what if we don't have Pascal's triangle? How we are going to solve this problem? In this case, we can use a formula and here's a formula n factorial divided by k factorial n minus k factorial. Now let's use this formula in order to solve this problem. n choose k means 15 choose 5. Let's put numbers. So 15 factorial divided by 5 factorial 15 minus 5 factorial which would equal to 15 factorial divided by 5 factorial and 10 factorial. We can represent 15 factorial as 15 times 14 times 13 times 12 times 11 times 10 factorial. And in denominator we are going to have 5 factorial and 10 factorial. So that means we can cross out 10 factorial here and 10 factorial here. And 5 factorial is going to be 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 and times 1. And our answer is going to be 3. 1003. Exactly the same number as we got using Pascal's triangle. And don't forget that uh, this type of notation means n choose k and this is combination problem where order of the events doesn't matter. And this is all for today. Thank you for your attention. Please subscribe for my new videos that I post almost every day and see you in the next video. Goodbye.